Clack him. In Clack northeast him. Baltimore, a canine officer and his Belgian Malinois are also on call as first responders if Maryland has a terrorist crisis. The breed often serves in military war zones. Primarily, they'd be bomb detection. Uh, I think secondary would be suspect apprehension. In this week's raid on Osama bin Laden's compound, a military dog participated in the raid, likely a Malinois or German Shepherd. Officer Bett's wife runs a Malinois dog rescue. The breed loves to work. They have to be mentally and physically stimulated. So the military using them isn't a surprise at all because they fit into smaller spaces where sometimes German Shepherds can't go. The vets say that the Malinois breed is not the best one to have as a household pet. They require constant stimulation, not just two walks a day, but they do make perfect soldiers. The Belgian Malinois are not as prone to the hip dysplasia as the German Shepherds. They fit into smaller places, they can work longer. The number of dogs used by the military is growing. Right now, 600 are at work in Iraq and Afghanistan. Afghanistan. They can run up to 35 miles an hour, and a terrorist or any man would have a hard time getting away. Officer Betts says kudos to the handler and dog that took out bin Laden. Good job. Proud of you. Proud of you, son. Proud of you. Suzanne Collins, WJZ Eyewitness News.